Now! Release me! People of Firenze, come, gather round! Listen well to what I say. The end approaches. Now is the time to repent! To beg God's forgiveness! Don't you see? These signs are all around us. Unrest, famine, disease, corruption. These are the harbingers of darkness. We must stand firm in our devotion, lest they consume us all. I see you, Dad, that you think me mad. But did the Romans not say the same of Jesus? Know that I, too, once shared your uncertainty, your fear. But that was before Savonarola came to me. He showed me the truth. At last, my eyes were opened. And so I stand before you today in the hope that I might open yours as well. What are you saying? What's that? It's all upon the precipice. On one side. The shining, glorious kingdom of God. On the other, a bottomless pit of despair. Will you turn back to the Lord? Or will you cast yourself into darkness? Already you stand precariously on the edge. Men like the Medici and the other families you once called masters sought earthly goods and gains. They abandoned their beliefs in favor of material pleasures. And they would have seen you all do the same. Our wise prophet once said, the only good thing that we owe to Plato and Aristotle is that they brought forward many arguments which we can use against the heretics. Yet they and other philosophers are now in hell. If you value your immortal so souls, you turn back from this unholy course and embrace the yes, words of our prophet, Savonarola. You will sanctify your bodies and spirits. You will discover the glory of God. You will at last become what our creator intended, loyal. And obedient servants. But that was before Savonarola came to me. He showed me the truth. At last, my eyes were opened. mind, since it is your own. <laughs> Not all of us require deception to be convinced. I already believed. All I said is true. Nothing is true. Non è un compito facile il mio. Requiescat in pace. Just don't.
Si passa. Do you hear me? Until you've all submitted and given yourself over to the prophet, Savonarola, this bridge will remain closed to you. I hear you moaning and complaining. You say you have things to do, places to go, obligations to fulfill. Ha! You have but one obligation, to submit. Get down from <laughs> Why fight us? Why raise it? is ours. Your precious Medici have abandoned you, fled into the waste to wallow in self-pity. <clears throat> Savonarola wants only the best no. for you. A city free of vice and temptation. A people united by faith. All men are equal in the eyes of the Lord. And so they shall be in Firenze. <laughs> This is a chance for us to turn over a new leaf, to leave behind our miserable past, and return to... So there won't be enough of you left to bury! I can't see him anymore. I see him. Not you. <laughs> now you die. We're a noble's close. How is it Savonarola charmed you? Wealth and power do not ensure contentment. I wanted even more. And now instead, you have nothing. Questo non è che un atto dovuto. Requiescat in pace.